Babe, what do you mean? Huh? I don't even know this girl. What are you trying to say right now? Huh? So you'd heard of somebody telling you that I spent some time with this girl today without telling you? Matter of fact, this is not even true. This is a, a lie. I don't know who told you this. <sighs> Why? Tell me the name. Was it one of your girlfriends? Who? Ashley, right? If you don't want to tell me her name, I probably know who is it. Can you please look me in the eyes and tell me what the problem is? Because right now, you just told me, yeah, that I was spending some time with some girl today, which is not even true, because I was on the road today, you know, working on my business, yeah, and accumulate and make money, obviously, and there was no single girl around me at all, okay? <sighs> Why are you doing this? Babe, can you please say something instead of just watching me looking at me like real mad even though I didn't do anything wrong? And it's the truth, I didn't do anything wrong. I don't understand. So who told you that? Let's please sit down and talk like adults, okay? And have a really genuine, serious conversation right now so we can cut this shit off, you know? Okay. So somebody sent you a photo, okay? Well then, show me the photo. Show me the photo and I will tell you and show you that it's not real. Show me right now. I'm waiting. Come on. Yeah, why? Because you are attacking me without knowing the truth. You are just thinking, okay, you saw a picture that somebody sent at you and you think that this is the truth instead of believing me and trust me as your boyfriend. Come on, now show me a picture, the picture. Okay. Okay. I got your phone now. So this picture here. Do you mean this picture here? Right now, I take a look, okay? I take a look here and realize that this is just a fake photo. I first, 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 this picture here, right? Is completely fake it's Photoshop you can see it here like look at the edges right here so the first thing I don't even know this girl who's this I never saw her before never and also second one the fact that this picture is fake because it's all Photoshop this is not true. I was hot today, you know, just in the office, on the road to the office, spending my time the whole day, these eight hours, right? 
I spend these hours just in the office. <sighs> and there was no girl at all. There were just my business partners who are all male, okay? All men and no women around us. Yeah, because we are actually working, okay? Making money, okay? So I can provide for you, yeah? And for us, our future, you know? So what? Do you still think that th this is me? <sighs> yes, I'm really mad right now. Because you don't even trust me. You just showed me right now that you truly believe what someone else were sending you. You were believing this instead of believing me and trusting me. I mean, this hurts. And I hate this pain. And you know, all these other girls that I had before you, they did the same thing to me. They were all not trusting me. They were all like terrorizing me pretty much every single day. How can I even endure this all? I mean, I really tried to be the best man I could ever be. And still you do the same like all these other women. So you believe me, huh? Yeah, and you see it right now. Yeah, as you look right now to the photo, you realize it's not true, right? Because it's completely fake, fake shit. No, don't touch me right now. I have to think. Think about what? Well, how this is going to end. <sighs> you know what? It's exhausting. You know, I do everything for you. Every single day. I try to be the best the best human being on earth to just being able to give you everything that I have and everything that I am. <sighs> Why do you do this? What? Yeah, you can say it. What would you want to say? So you're sorry now. You are saying sorry right now. For not trusting me unconditionally. And trusting some other person that you are literally don't even know. A person that sent you a photo that you don't even know. I mean, which number is that? Whose numbers is that? It's fake. I guess it's, that is someone who <sighs> tries to... Destroy this relationship, our relationship. I mean, I have a lot of haters out there, or a lot of women that trying to chase me, and when they realize 
that they can't have me because I'm with you. They try to manipulate, manipulate everything here in our relationship. So you got to be careful, baby. It's okay. It's okay. I'm breathing right now. So I can calm down a little bit and get more clarity in my mind. No, I forgive you. No, I won't quit now. No, no. I give you another chance, that's for sure. Though it was the first time, but I hope that this was the first time and the last time. And that these type of situations never happen again, okay? You should really trust me, because I trust you. You can go wherever you want, do whatever you want, and I see, you know, how you treat the relationship. And it's all good. But... I don't need to worry about these type of things because I trust you. Even if you are spending with some men in a club or whatever with your friends and stuff, I truly trust you and know that you won't do anything wrong. So, yeah, it has to be on both sides, okay? So this way it can work. Yeah, it can work. Our relationship can work then. Come here. I never wanted to scream or be mad or get in an argument with you. Truly not. And I... Really... I'm sorry that I screamed that much. And showed you like another... Perspective of mine. Another character side. The beast... Yeah, I have a beast inside me. So please, never do this again, okay? Come here, in my arms. I forgive you. And I still love you from the day we met. And I will always love you. Because I feel like that you are the one. And no matter what is coming, and no matter how many enemies or people who are trying to bring us down or cross our relationship, don't believe that. We will conquer that, okay? I love you. Yeah, I love you too.